Now the story of an Indiana woman and why what should have been the happiest day of her life was also the scariest. She got married just hours before her heart transplant. Lindsay Buckingham shares this incredible story. At just 21 years old, Kimberly Woods of Goshen, Indiana is a pro at Plan B. As a young girl, she wanted to compete. What did they tell you when you were 12? Try not to do any sports, anything to get your heart rate up. That's because Kimberly has a heart condition called hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, causing the heart muscle to thicken. Over the next several years, it worsened. And then I turned 20 and I noticed something wasn't right. The situation, far more serious. One, uh, a risk of sudden cardiac death from arrhythmia, and the other one, is the risk of dying from the cardiomyopathy itself. First, Kimberly would need a defibrillator, and eventually she'd need a new heart. It was pretty rough, I mean, the first month afterwards, and just like, where does life go from now? Kimberly was on borrowed time, just as life was beginning with her greatest love, Anthony. Just heads up, like, it's gonna, it's gonna get rough. And he was like, I'm all for it. So they decided to make their commitment official, thinking that time was on their side. That's when we were like, let's get married. We were also able to say, it's okay, it's two, three years from now. Like, yep. We were able to not really fully put the pressure in the moment. It wouldn't be years. It was six months. We got the phone call that there was a perfect heart. Time for another plan B. On September 28th, 2021, Kimberly and Anthony summoned their closest family and friends to watch them say I do. You literally got married, drove for four hours, mm -hmm. checked into the hospital, and had a heart transplant. Yep. Wow. Yep. Arriving at the Cleveland Clinic for life-saving surgery, reality set in as Kimberly was wheeled back into the OR. Anthony, what was your greatest fear at that time? Losing her. That's always the biggest fear. Time stood still as Anthony waited for his new bride to emerge with a new heart and a new start. When he finally saw her... The thing that was going through my mind is I gotta be drug out of here. Like, there's no way I'm just gonna walk out. Kimberly will be just fine. If she takes care of it and we take care of her, I think uh, um, we hope for her to have a, a normal lifespan and a normal quality of life. A life Kimberly and Anthony know is unique the definition of in sickness and in health, and their commitment. He was there every day, <laughs> helped me, and um, his strength, definitely his strength. Is it possible to put into words how much you love your wife? Mm, prob probably not, or I'm going to need a couple more hours than this. <laughs> Just... Oh my gosh. Lindsay Buckingham, 3 News. Kimberly and Anthony tell us they have big, big plans. First, some travel, and then they'd love to start a family. And of course, a huge congrats to those newlyweds.